what is it? We're about to roll blunt of some, uh, I don't know, some random, see what we got going on. Some orange C. Um, it is 20.9% THC from Shadow Box Farms. Let's see what it smells like. Smells like oranges. Let's get it. So, ah, that smells good. We're going to smoke a blank, okay? Because that's what we do. I mean, we smoke weed. Smoke lots of weed. You have to smoke lots of weed, okay? Um, further, you know, to them homies out there who been, y'all been corrupting the message, okay? If I DP you online, you should probably do that discipline. I'm just being honest. Like, if I tell you I want a 5,000 word essay done within 72 hours, and you fail to comply, it's not going to be just, oh, he didn't do it. It's going to be a failure to fucking adapt. A failure to fucking to change. Like, you guys really thought this was a free-for-all? Like, I mean, no. No. I mean, you guys are in for a rude awakening. There's a lot of you guys are in for a rude fucking awakening. Further than that, okay, look. There's this little ingrate who's been running around the hood, right? His name's Temper. I'm not going to throw his real name out there, okay? Because I don't necessarily dislike the kid all that much. But he gets by on this this stick this 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 role. Oh he's harmless. He's just a little kid. He doesn't know no better. He doesn't you know no. No 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 no. This kid knows exactly what he's doing, y'all. And he he up in that shadow program. Up in the shadow program. Motherfucker snitching. He's snitching bruh. Help him build indictments. But I mean like really he is harmless, you know. Except for the fact that he he squeezes up like he nudges up to people that he thinks have status and so a year and a half ago he had my little ex-girlfriend um call me out of nowhere blade like out of nowhere like i mean this bitch doesn't even love me bro she you know what i'm not stupid i smell a setup i know when fucking you know Shit ain't genuine. You know what I'm saying, though? Especially when you got a bitch call you up and you know that she don't give none fucks about that North Day shit, right? So here's what you do, right? You ever have one of these hood rats call you up trying to set you up, right? You start speaking all kinds of bad about the cause, about the brand. And if they start trying to defend it, then bruh, like, you already know. Who they got behind them, okay? Probably some fucking believer that doesn't even know the first fucking, you know, basic concepts of the ideals that he chose to adopt and to call his wife. A.K.A. most of these rappers in this game. Um, especially fucking Big Tone. Don't like you, dude. I don't like you. But you're a fucking northern rider. Further than that, I kick your ass. You can't see me one-on-one, -on -one, bro. For real. And you can't put your money where your mouth is either. Because you ain't got it. Now I take that back. You probably pull a good, what? 30, 40 grand every harvest. And I'm being generous. I'm being generous. So. You should probably do yourself a fucking 5,000 word essay. That's what you should do, bruh. Yup. 
you know. So I just get off the phone with the homie, right? And he's a big homie. Um, and, you know, he's just, you know, we's on the same page. We's on the same page. We let some of these motherfuckers run around and rap about some shit that they wasn't allowed to rap about. That even the umbrellas that they were standing under, it was questionable. You know, these individuals was throwing Northern Rider fucking symbology all up in their lyrics. Who's like, ooh, you in trouble, boy. And just like I told the homie. I said, and he even agreed. What it's going to come down to is values are going to be weighed. Worths are going to be weighed. Sacrifices are going to be weighed. And if you were functioning in a street regiment that was hijacked from the FBI, by the FBI, and was primarily focused on hurting our youths into profiles of terror oh, bruh. like whatever letters you thought you had kiss them lovers goodbye just kiss them goodbye say goodbye to them bro because they ain't real not no more um further than that you know we've been making our youths think that we're supposed to be a gang bro no we're not supposed to be a gang. There's nothing about us that was supposed to be a gang. And you Northern Riders, you think that you're not the people still. I can get you touched on your own yards. These are true facts, bro. These are true facts, bro. So... Orange C is how it be. I love marijuana, bro. I love marijuana. I love marijuana more than more than my girlfriend, more than my sister, more than my mom, more than my kids. More than you. More than any one of you combined. I love marijuana more. Yes, my son. I'm sorry, kid. Okay? You were alright. I mean, I thought you were black when you first came out. I walked out of that hospital room quicker than shit. I don't know who this kid is. That ain't my kin. That ain't my kin. I love doing that. French inhaling. I remember when I was 14 years old. I taught myself how to do that. <coughs> so anyways. You been sharing my shit. Downloading it. I love you for that. I love you for that. Speak out against childhood sex crimes. It fucks kids up. It really does. Smoke lots of weed. We got some new strains coming at you. Brand new strains. Never smoked before. Completely fucking crossbred. Um, just some new shit. Got some... Some 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 herba some herbologists in my corner, bro. Okay, but see when I pop up, I just pop up, and people don't know. They don't know who is this guy. I am that motherfucker. I'm sorry to tell you, there's a lot of people who done claimed to be that motherfucker. I am. Him. And he's me, blood. And we are we.
fucking legion. This is the truth. It's the truth. I hate it when it gets down like that towards the end. <laughs> you have to loosen it up again, cause if not, you won't get a. Uh, you won't get that pull, bro. That pull, bro. So I just <coughs> ex girlfriend when I was young. She has a bomb ass chocha. She used to make me wear women's panties, bro. To this day, she's got a picture of me in women's panties. And she's had it since 7th grade, bro. Straight up. Little bitch. That pussy, though. Actually, she's had it since 10th grade. I take that back. <laughs> Fucking bitch. F flaunting that pussy in front of you like, what is it, right? And you're just like. But I remember I got her. First time I fucked her, I got her. I was hella drunk, and it wasn't really all that bomb, so I kind of faked, you know? First time I ever faked an orgasm on a bitch. That's my thing. I will fake an orgasm on you, ho, okay? And then I will go in the bathroom, and I will jack off, and then I will leave, okay? Because some of you bitches, you think that that is just like rubber, man. Like, you can just torture it and abuse it and, and you don't have to worry about it no you have to worry about it okay because sooner or later you can throw a fucking hot dog down that hallway and it ain't gonna it's gonna bounce off the walls and it's not even gonna hit the walls you know i mean just saying i'm not talking about her because her chow chow was actually pretty good it was actually pretty good. I mean, I haven't really been with a lot of women, but I can count them on my hands. You know? Um, if you had the wrinkles. <laughs> uh, yeah, you know? So I have this thing to where I don't ever tell nobody how many people I've been with. Because I've been locked up most of my life, so I haven't really had that much of an opportunity to knock shit down. But that lowers your standards a lot. It does, because the next thing you know, you're just like, fuck it, I'll knock it down. Bring it, knock it. I don't care if she's ugly, we can turn off lights. And, you know, um, just, if her face feels like you're reading Braille when you touch it, just don't touch it. Just don't touch it, bro. You know, fat women are cool because they got multiple tits in multiple parts of their bodies. So I'm all good with fucking fat bitches. I really am. All right, you guys, I got to go. I got to go. I got things to do. I gotta go pick somebody up. Navigate step four out.